Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the TeacherCast Educational Network. My name is Jeff Bradbury, and thank you so much for joining us today. We have a great program for you guys. If you like what you see, don't forget to check out the bottom of this video and like and subscribe to our channel. We would love to have you guys be a part of the TeacherCast Educational Network. Today, we're going to be talking all about Microsoft Teams with two amazing MIE expert trainers, Jenny and Salee, and we're going to be talking a little bit about how Teams can be used in your classroom today. If you've got any questions about Microsoft Teams and are looking for some more information, you can, of course, check out all the great stuff over at teachercast.net slash Microsoft Education, where we're going to have all of our videos from this series, and we would love to hear from you and help you find out the answers to your questions. But before we get into all of that stuff, I want to bring on our good friends, Jenny and Salee. Welcome to the program. Talk to us a little bit about how you guys are using Microsoft Teams in your classroom. Microsoft Teams is a digital hub that brings together so many things in one place. Some people say it's an LMS or a digital classroom, but we like to say it's the mecca, mecca for collaboration. collaboration. So it really is a learning platform that offers so much more. It offers communication, content creation, collaboration. The more we've used it, the more we have found it really is a place for student-driven learning. That's fantastic. I am so looking forward to learning more. Of course, this is the first video in a multi-video series where we're going to be taking apart Microsoft Teams and helping you guys figure out how to use it in your classrooms. So let's get started. Talk to us a little bit about what we can do with Microsoft Teams? That's a great question, Jeff. Thank you for asking. Why would someone use Teams? With Teams, you can collaborate, you can stay organized, and you can even save time. We use Teams to collaborate by inserting OneNotes, Flipgrid. There's even a chat feature built into Teams. You can also have a conversation that's ongoing, and there's even Skype. So you can set up a meeting and Skype face-to-face -face with everyone involved. We love the organization that Teams offers. You can use the added OneNote that comes with the team when you create it, or you can even add your own OneNotes. You can also even add a class notebook. There are channels built into the teams as well, and you can add specific channels for your content or for your different topics that you are discussing with your group. You can also use the file section to share documents, PowerPoints, videos, or any file that you want to upload to be shared by the participants. And it saves time. You can insert other applications as well. So if you already have a lesson created in Quizlet or even Nearpod, you can add that app and students can access the content. Not only that, there is an assignments tab where you can make assignments and add rubrics to those assignments. So it makes grading super simple. Jenny and Salih, thank you so much for sharing a little bit about Microsoft Teams. There are so many different things that they can do. Why don't you tell us a little bit about where we can find more information about Microsoft Teams? Well, definitely check out the Microsoft Educator community. There are courses that you can go through that will take you through a deeper experience with Teams, anywhere from beginner level all the way up to intermediate. So we definitely encourage you to go there. You can also earn points and badges. To access your Teams, go ahead and go to your Office 365 portal and log in, and you will see the icon there for you to access Teams. You can also check out at Microsoft Teams and definitely use the hashtag TeamsMania. So as you can see, there's a lot of great things about Microsoft Teams and lots of reasons why you should be using it in your classroom. This is just the first video in a number of videos that we're going to be putting together out here on TeacherCast. Don't forget to check out that subscribe button below. Click on the bell to get notified for your videos. And don't forget to check out all the great stuff over at TeacherCast.net slash Microsoft EDU. That's TeacherCast.net slash Microsoft EDU. And on behalf of Jenny and Celine and everybody here in the TeacherCast Educational Network, my name is Jeff Bradbury, reminding you to keep up the great work in your classrooms and continue sharing your passions with your students.